You ever have one of those days? I don't have very many of them. I found that pocket watch at the top of that hill. And I walked down, and I found like a dime and two pennies, all modern. Kept walking, kept walking, and I knew, it, you know, there's a couple of washes and stuff. And I got down to the bottom, and there's an old dry creek run, and I saw a bunch of modern trash and tires. And I said, oh, I'll go. And as I turned to leave, I noticed something. We'll get to that. But I called Mitchell, and I told him, hey, you know, I'm going to be going down in this dry creek run, you know, trying to be safe. You know, here's some pipes and stuff, all modern, lots of, you know, stuff that's here it's all washed up all this stuff but as I was talking to Mitchell I looked down and I saw two bottles and that's after I'd already noticed the thing that's down the creek well I got down here I was on the phone with him I said please God let that be whole please God let that be whole and it is and I just dug it up I'm going to show you before I cry I, if you ain't into bottles I'm sorry it is what it is this is Sofa King. Awesome. Sofa King. Two words. Sofa King. Awesome. Look at this. Look at that. I was on the phone with him, and I said, I don't know what that is, but I sure hope it's whole, because all I could see was, like, this rim and how thick it was. And it is whole, and it says, Jackson, Tennessee. Holy crap, it's got a chip right there. It's got another one right there. I don't care. That thing has got to be old. It is freaking awesome. Do you hear me? That is freaking awesome. Look at that. Coca-Cola. I don't know when that's from. 20s or 30s maybe? I don't know. I really don't know my bottles. But if you know, can somebody please tell me? I know there's the Pat D, Cokes. You know, I know those. I've seen those, and some of them are, like, from the 20s. But when is this from? It just says Coca-Cola. And on the other side, it says Jackson, Tennessee. Hang on, there might be some small little little things right there. Oh, here's something. R-0-0-1. I don't know. I don't see a date, though. Can anybody date this bottle for me? It's really thick. It's kind of like that blue-green glass. And then I also noticed, while on the phone with Mitchell, let me lay this little baby to the side. First of all, look here. Here's some awesome pottery. Look at that. But I noticed this other bottle over here. And I thought it was a Pepsi bottle. Well, there's there's whiskey, I guess, right there. But I thought that was Pepsi. But now I don't I don't think it's Pepsi. It's definitely embossed. And, I mean, there, look, there is broken glass and, and modern trash everywhere. But I saw this one. I thought it was Pepsi. What is it? King Cotton. King Cotton. What is King Cotton? I've never heard of that. I keep hearing stuff in the woods above me. Animals and crap scaring the heck out of me. Whew. Glad I got my knives. All my stuff. All right. King Cotton. Does anybody know what King Cotton is? King Cotton. I've never heard of that. If anybody knows, can you please help? King Cotton. Because I don't have time to look it up right now. Um, anyway, I don't think you're going to be able to see this. I know you can see the trash. But there's a tire down there. And when I was standing up on the hill, I could see it. I can't see it now. But just this side of that tire, there's a there's a pot down there. It's white, and there's a, a, some cinder blocks. But there is a glass insulator laying in the creek. And when I was talking to Mitchell, I turned to leave, and I noticed it. And I said, what? That's when I called him. I was like, hey, I'm not going anywhere. I am getting this creek run. And, you know, for safety's sake, you should always call. Let somebody know, hey, little change of plans, not going to be right up there around the school or whatever, just to let him know, hey, I'm here, I'm just not here, here. And, hey, bring a rope. You may have to come rescue me. But I'm going to go get that insulator. And I just got two awesome bottles. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed, be safe, and happy hunting.